So today is the ayahuasca ceremony. I am a little bit nervous. I'm excited to be on this journey with my brother and best friend, Mr. Zen Master Ep. I'm gonna go to the grocery store right now and fill up on fruits and vegetables and just drink a ton of water today. I'm trying to keep my system nice and clean uh, for the ceremony. We haven't talked about this much, but Brandon and I have used psychedelics before as a means of education, as a means of learning more about yourself. And for those who don't feel comfortable with psychedelics, you don't have to be. I'm not trying to convince you to take them. I'm just saying my personal experience with taking psychedelics, they have helped me look inside myself and see things about myself that I either know that I need to deal with or improve. Also, I'm gonna go jump rope now, sweat out as much as I can, clean my system out, drink a ton of water, eat a ton of fruit and vegetables, probably meditate in the sauna and just sweat. Yo, what's up, Zen Dude Nation? I just got back from sweating my balls off. Yo, I'm really bad at documenting, but I wanted to show you guys real quick what I got, because I'm about to take ayahuasca in T minus seven hours. I ate most of it already, so again, I'm sorry. Broccoli. I had two things of blueberries. I already consumed those. I had a green juice. I had one apple. Probably have one of these oranges. I'm gonna fill this bad boy up again and drink a third one of these. Part of the reason I'm going to do ayahuasca tonight is to continue to break through this barrier of social anxiety. So for anyone out there who's nervous or afraid to take a big step, whether it be in business, in a relationship, or whatever it is, take the step, be uncomfortable. What I'm hoping is that what I'm saying right now inspires you, no matter what is going on mentally inside of yourself, that you just start taking daily action towards those big goals. And you're gonna have so many days where you're in awkward positions and you feel crappy, you feel like you wanna run back to your old ways, your comfort zone. Don't do it, guys. Like, standing here before you today, I can honestly say I am the happiest I have ever been in my entire life. And it's all because I continue to go into those uncomfortable places and recognize that they can't harm me. We're about to leave, shit's gonna get weird. I love you guys. If you are afraid to do something, that's all the more reason to do it. And here comes Brandon. medicine and right now this traffic ain't moving i'm trying to have revelations about my life and i can't seem to get anywhere we're almost there the place that we're going to it's not really one of those places that you put into your gps it's you know one of those places where you just kind of pull up into a town and ask the townspeople <laughs> where the place is This guy really wants us to park in this space. All right, we are going to the ceremony. We just got to this town. We just arrived, camera's going off. Psych! 